everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome to my home, welcome to my channel, and welcome to my weekly vlog. And I'm calling it Coffee, Tea, Wine, and Life because, well, I need its title and, yeah, I'm, I just couldn't think of anything original. But I want to thank everyone again for joining me. The last two weeks, I've really had a lot of fun chit-chatting with you every night and sharing part of my life with you. And I hope that you feel free to share part of your life with me. And it's just um, so much fun getting to know each and every one of you. And I appreciate you more than you know. But um, anyway, so getting into the vlog this week. So I'm really, today I got up, I went to bed probably about 3 or 4 o'clock this morning and woke up about seven because I could hear the kids outside playing and it's just such a happy sound and um, and you know they're not going to be outside playing for too much longer so I just thought I might as well get up and get started so anyway I knew I wanted to piece together my vlog from last week and I'm so happy it was like 10 to 15 minutes shorter than my first week so I'm going in the right direction I'm hoping to uh be a little shorter because I know it's it takes a lot of time to watch these so I totally um understand if you fast forward through different parts or whatever but um anyway it's just it's just a lot of fun and it, it's a nice outlook for me to uh, chit chat with someone at night and um anyway so got that done and then i just watched a couple of hours worth of videos this morning and i've been commenting and then i heard the mailman's truck and you know how um you know, we used to think it was funny that Sir Stetson and I, Brittany, could hear our, my husband's truck from like three blocks away. And he would just get excited, jumping up and down. And he had a little stumpy tail, but it would be going like crazy, because he was a Brittany and he didn't really have a tail. And um, anyway, I'm getting to be the same way. I could hear the mailman um, from a few doors down, or the UPS man. Do you think I'm part dog, or is it just something that... You just get to know and love those sounds. But anyway, I knew that these pajamas were out for delivery today. And uh, last week I had started my vlog with my pajamas from Carol Hockman from QVC. And I love those ones. They are so soft. They're so comfortable. And um, QVC was having like, you know, another thing and the fall things and five easy pays. And so anyway, they had, I was going to get another pair. But then I saw this velour pair on her site. And it's a light pink animal print. And, of course, it's velour that's nice and soft. And I thought, well, going into winter, maybe I need something a little heavier. So I'm really excited to get these. And even though they're velour, you can see they are still nice and soft and stretchy. They're like this jogger type thing. So they've got this uh, at the bottom. And, then of course, I got my flux on. And I'm just loving these. So, anyway, I wanted to throw them on real quick. And I thought, well, I might as well stop my vlog. So I had to go and put some makeup on because, yeah, I didn't have any makeup on. So I do like this kind of fall look with these fall colors. So we'll see how that turns out. It's a little bit brighter than I usually do. So hopefully it isn't uh, too bad. Sorry, I got that one grippy eye spill. And um, yeah, so then I'm gonna throw them in the washing machine with my sheets and get them going. And then, you know, I'm thinking I might put on my Halloween costume, yeah. Yeah, and do some videos because, yeah, I'm so far behind. And I feel really bad because I wanted to do my Scentsy Whip Box last month, the September Whip Box, in costume, in the foyer, in front of all my decorations, and with all my Scentsy things up around me. And, of course, I didn't get to do that. And I feel really bad just in case somebody wanted to get that box. But, um, anyway, hopefully if I get that loaded, even though you can't get that September box anymore, um, it might get you thinking that maybe you want to try the Scentsy box and order the one for October. Because pretty soon my October box is going to be shipping and I haven't even got the September one opened yet. So I want to get that done. Um, I've had that Simply Gilded subscription kit on the back of my bed for a while because the box is so pretty and I think it makes a ni really nice backdrop. But I also got in the Villa Beautiful and the So Cute Planner. So I've got three planner subscription kits I want that I want to um, get opened and put away because it might be something I want to use in my planner this week and uh, get my Scentsy with box done. So I'm going to get them filmed. I don't know if I'm going to get them uploaded, but I'm definitely going to get that done. And then I'm going to get back to work on YouTube because I really, I really enjoy that. It's, it's a lot more work than I think I, I realized how much it was going to be uh, work. Just not so much um, uploading and doing things like that. Just uh, reaching out to people that, um, you know, watching their videos and commenting. And I don't, just start to watch it and then write something down and then disappear. I do watch the whole 
videos when I watch other people's videos. So it, it does take a lot of time, but I really, really enjoy it. I love getting to know everybody and comment on the videos. It's just a lot of fun for me. So I am going to close the vlog for today and we will chat again tomorrow. Bye-bye. Hi everyone and welcome back to the House of Madness. We are all mad here, so I hope you join me and have a little fun with the madness and just dressing up, having fun. You know, life is full of challenges and responsibilities, so if you get a chance to dress up and have a little fun, I say go for it. But anyway, I have got my cafe macchiato here. It did have whipped cream, but it melted. Well, I actually, I actually ate it. But anyway, it's, oh, I can't believe it's Sunday night, and I'm just getting on to do my vlog. It's about, I'm going to have a sip before I put this down. Hmm. I love a good cup of coffee. But anyway, it is about 8 o'clock at night, and the day has just really got away from me. Um, just uh, normal Sunday things, you know, that you do on the weekend with vacuuming and laundry and dusting and blah, 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 blah. And actually, I went outside with my leaf blower today and got all the leaves out from um, in between the shrubs and things. And my neighbor's going to take my mower. He uh, put the mulching thing on it for the leaves. So he's going to mulch up the leaves in my yard in his yard tomorrow. So I did my part. Well, kind of. I could have really done it myself, but I think he enjoys it. Yeah. And I got a few more things on my Halloween table. Um, so looking forward to maybe finishing that up this week. I probably won't because I say that every week and, and I, I don't. By the time I get home, I, I don't feel like going up and down the stairs. But anyway i do enjoy decorating for the holidays for our halloween and fall and and bringing up my nutcrackers for christmas so um you know that's it's just a fun time of year and um yeah so i think that's about it i just wanted to pop in for a few minutes and uh, say hi to everyone hope everyone had a great weekend and i hope everyone wherever you are you had a you're happy and you're healthy you're safe um you know our health we we take so much for granted so if you are plagued with any any health issues i do wish you the best and um and sending prayers out for everyone to to be safe and we will chat again soon we'll talk to you tomorrow bye bye hi everyone welcome to monday so first day of the week that's always just so exciting to have that first day of work done so um anyway i decided to come home and i, I always try to do a mask on monday night i, I don't always get to it but I, I always try just to have that done so i thought what better way than to put my mask on and do my vlog and then have two things done for the week right uh two things done for the day but anyway here i am and all my glamour because I thought I owed it to you after dressing up in my Halloween costume yesterday and doing some videos with my Halloween costume on. I just thought you might expect me to be glamorous again. So anyway, here I am. I know, not so much. But anyway, hoping that these masks maybe help turn back the hands of time a little bit. Maybe soften some of the, my crow's feet and the lines I have. I don't know how people get this to stay straight, stay, stay on their face. And just uh, hydrate my skin. So I'm... I'm really enjoying doing this masking ser series and um, you know I really owe it to uh, Justina because if it wasn't for Justina and I wasn't watching her Monday morning mask series and 111 mask from her I never would have got started on this so I'm really appreciative of that so thank you so much Nina and you are making my complexion better so that's always good but anyway since I'm going to the dark side with all this uh, you know getting beauty boxes and doing things like this yeah I'm really I'm really crossing over this no turning back now I bought us some hand mask so I am really looking forward to trying this to just see what they're all about my hand you know they just get so dry and so anyway and plus you use the, the hand sanit sanitizer all the time and yeah so I'm I'm looking forward to trying these so I got these on Amazon there was a pack of five for $8.99 and of course with Prime free shipping and I had it like the next day because well Shaq piece just down the street from me but anyway so I'm looking forward to uh trying this and see what it's about I know they do have some of the masks on the site that are like over $20 for a single mask but I just kind of wanted to get a feel to see how they're all about so if you have any suggestions on the hand mask how often you do them do you just do them once a week or do you do them once a month are there any brands that are better than others that you have found and anyway so I am going to uh lay down maybe so this uh doesn't keep uh 
coming undone, and um, we'll chat again tomorrow. I hope you go out and have a fantastic day. Hi everyone, happy Wednesday. Welcome to my vlog and my little mess here. Anyway, I stopped at Duncan's on the way home. Got a large coffee and I've had to reheat it, so I've got it in this cup, so I'll have a quick little sip and get on with our vlog. Anyway, loving the Duncan's coffee. I am so happy that they finally put one in around me. And oh, it's just, just such a beautiful day. So anyway, it was supposed to be up in the 80s, like close to 80 today. So last night I picked out some, a dress that I wanted to wear because, you know, pretty soon I'm not going to want to wear dresses. And I got up this morning and it was like, I just want to go to work and be comfortable. I, I, I don't, I don't want to dress up. I don't want to put nylons on. I don't want to wear a dress. Don't make me. So anyway, I ended up picking out a um, pair of corduroy pants to some uh, little bell-bottom flare corduroys in a kind of like an olive color with my camo sneakers. I've got this dolman top and kind of like that uh, olive green that I got from my Wannable box. I got this necklace that I got from my grand granddaughter Tori Pie. I think she got this at Target for me, but it's all kind of beautiful fall colors and nice gold tone and the layered look. And then these earrings are the ones that I got from Alicia Martin that she sent me in the giveaway last week. So loving those. I thought it just kind of created a fun look. And even though I didn't want to dress up, I still kind of want it to look like fun. Like I put some effort into my look today, but I didn't put any effort in at all. Yeah. Some days you just don't feel like it. You just want to go to work. I mean, I, I put in a, an 11 hour day again and I just want to be comfortable. I don't know if, this, if that's wrong or not, but anyway, we didn't have customers coming in. So yeah, I was good. But today I got a new box to my channel and I've been looking at this box for a long time because Barbara from BC Sales, if you've watched her, <laughs> yeah, who am I kidding? Everybody watches Barbara, right? But uh, she's been getting this Sudsy Club box for such a long time. And every time I see her open it, I say, oh yeah, I'm going to get that. Oh yeah, I'm going to go on later and, and I'll sign up and I'll get it. Well, I never do. Well, I finally did. So I got this. So I'm going to open this later and share that with everyone. And then because I have been on this soap kick lately, I did buy some more soap from another Etsy, from a different Etsy company, and this one's Boodles Doodles Designs, and it's just really cute. This one's called the Dirty Birdie Soap, so I'm looking forward to uh, sharing some of this soap with you, and uh, yeah, so I just wanted to kind of keep it short, but oh yeah, Tori, I wanted to tell you a little Tori Pie story. So we, we try to FaceTime a couple of times a, a week and just kind of keep in touch that way. And uh, she's got a test that she's uh, studying for. So we chit-chatted a little bit on Monday. We, we started out FaceTiming and then she, she, she FaceTimes, but then she texts you at the same time. So for me, it's, you know how hard it is for me to go back and forth, back and forth. So anyway, she wanted, she's studying, um, her test is on this Friday, but it's on citizenship and how do you become a citizenship and how do you become a citizen and all this stuff. But so anyway, so then she wanted to text me the question and then go back to FaceTime and I would ask her the question and then she will FaceTime me the answer and then she would text me the next question. And I'll go, why don't we just do the whole thing in FaceTime? Why do we have to keep going back and forth between chatting and ch chatting and doing FaceTime? And she says, this is how I do it, Grammy. The teacher asks the questions and I give the answer. Capiche? And I'm like, capiche? I said, where did this little girl learn more words like this? So anyway, I'm like, who the heck is this? And what did you do with Tori? And so anyway, just had a, a good laugh, but she was spot on on all her answers. It was, uh, I just couldn't believe how good she was and so smart. And uh, so anyway, we, we did it again tonight. She wanted to do the same thing tonight to practice a little bit more. And she's, uh, I can just tell she's got herself all worked up about this. She's got, you know, that test on the citizen becoming a citizen and citizens rights and blah 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 and then she's also got a spelling test and I think it's just because you know the end of the year they didn't have school with the COVID and then um, you know and then so now she's back in that school setting where it's not just online and answering questions every now and then and so I think she's got herself a little worked up about having to have a face-to-face -face test but you know, so just kind of chatted with her a little bit and said, you got this, Tori. You got it. You got all the answers down pat. 
just don't get overconfident just kind of take a deep breath relax and go over it you got you know tonight you got tomorrow to go over it again just write it down and just keep repeating the answers and you got this and relax so anyway we'll see how she does probably chat a little bit with her tomorrow and then wishing her luck on friday for both her tests so i know she'll do well but anyway i want to thank everyone and we will chat again tomorrow hope you have a great day bye bye and hi everyone welcome to thursday so I wore my matching mask today. I feel like saying good morning because I just woke up. But anyway, Thursday. So today I ended up wearing this uh, dress. Uh, and I've worn the, the duster top before, but I've worn it like over blue jeans. And then I've worn it over like black leggings and a top. But today I actually wore it with the, uh, the navy maxi dress that came with it. And of course I got a little bit of sparkle going on here with my Touchstone Swarovski earrings and blush. And this necklace that I love from Sabrina, and Mike and the Jelly Beans, one Christmas. It's by Kirk's Folly. It's just all different phases of the moon and all different kind of etchings and crystals. So it's just really pretty. And I thought with that color and the shape of the moons, just kind of went really nice with this dress. Oh, but anyway, just another long day. So I knew before I left work that I had gotten in some sticker kits that were delivered from another Etsy shop that I like to use called Lemon and Honey from Hastings, Minnesota. And I had a Target order that came in and I had ordered two videos in that order. So I was excited to get home. I wanted to watch one. Didn't know which one I wanted to watch yet, but I knew I was going to watch one. And so I decided on the way home, I was going to stop at Target. I was just going to grab something quick for dinner because I didn't know what I wanted. And so anyway, I'm walking to the store and over by the deli, I thought, well, maybe I'll just get another one of those chickens. But anyway, New England clam chowder caught my eye. So I thought I would come home and have some New England clam chowder, nice kind of cozy comfort food. Not as good as, you know, what I would have got back home or one that I could make myself, but yeah, I figured it would do. Anyway, promptly put it in the microwave, grabbed my movies, sat on the couch so I could start ripping the plastic off, fell asleep for almost three hours yeah so gonna have to excuse my uh couch here that couch is dangerous i tell you don't sit on it unless you don't mind falling asleep but anyway the movies that i got so i got our one hallmark movie the christmas under wraps with candace cameron Bure, and i just love watching the hallmark christmas movies they just put you in such a happy mood and then i got a halloween one and I don't even remember the last time I watched Hocus Pocus. But anyway, I got this in the re-release in the 4K. So I'm excited to uh, check that out and watch it again. And then the movies that I got. I mean, the uh, stickers that I got. I just showed you the movies. Like I said, I'm, I'm not awake. But I got to... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have a sip of my coffee. Maybe that'll help me wake up, right? Though I could have this cup of coffee, sit on the couch, and go right out again. But anyway, I got three of these sticker kits from Lem Lemon and Honey Studios. This one's a nice fall themed. And of course, it's got a cup of coffee and some nice fall scenes in there. And then for um, October, I want to do every week in October in a Halloween kit. So I got this one from her. This looks really, really pretty. Nice purples and blacks and witches and Ouija boards. And then uh, this one too. And, um, you know, her kits just have so many things. And I can never flip through these, right? The papers, like buttery soft matte and kind of thick. But anyway, I, I love using her kits. Just all kinds of deco and boxes. So always something good to use. But um, anyway, I think, I think that's about it. I also got another kit in that. I had canceled... Um, my subscription last year or something yeah last year last october i canceled it and anyway i decided to give it another try so uh, that came in today if i wake up enough i will try to get that video done today and um and if i do i have to do something with my hair otherwise i'll try maybe try to get to it this weekend so i hope everyone goes out and has a fantastic day tomorrow and we'll chat again soon bye bye hi everybody welcome to friday so the last day of my vlog so i want to thank everyone for stopping in and visiting i really enjoyed talking to you every night this is actually the third time that i'm trying to tape this or tape do this the first time i went into eight minutes and that was just too long so then i thought well i'm going to do it a little bit faster it was 11 minutes and i was still talking so 
twenty four seconds now so i'm going to try to go a little bit quicker but anyway so thank you again everyone for joining me and i just had a few things that i wanted to go over today and that to mention and the first one was on youtube the channel the show must go on it's an awesome awesome channel and um today um for 20 for 48 hours starting at two o'clock eastern time today you can watch the phantom of the opera the 25th anniversary uh edition that they taped at the royal albert hall in in england um they played it earlier this summer it's free and you, oh my god i just love it so um even if you don't think that you got you like musicals like that um there are just some parts of that that you just you're just in awe at these voices. So for 48 hours, you get to watch that. And again, it's uh, the show must go on. And that started at Friday, 2 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. So I hope you get a chance to check it out. It is free and it is an awesome, awesome show. Um, next, Ever Eve. <clears throat> um, so anyway, Ever Eve, I got an, an invitation in the mail today from them. Just really, really nice. Um, so they sent a little letter, a little type note inside a kind of thank you card. And it's just thanking uh, for thanking us for the support during the COVID shutdown, earning the 2020 pass. They are having a Maple Eve. Uh, uh, I'm trying to rush now because I want to, I, I just want to be around two minutes and I'm not, I'm not doing so good. But anyway, try not to rush. So the, the store that I have is the Maple Grove store in Minnesota, and they are having a birthday um, anniversary party. And it's Sunday at Octo October 11th from noon to 6, where you can get 15% uh, off anything in the store. And of course, mix it with your 10% 2020 style pass. But you know, I haven't been in a store really since um, the whole COVID thing started. So I've done, you know, the essentials. I've done the Dunkin' Donuts drive through I've done the McDonald's drive-through once or twice. Um, I've done the, the grocery store, and uh, you know Target and the regular grocery store, and um, the, the most essential store, the liquor store, and that's all I've been to since April. So and work. So I don't know if I'm ready to go into a store. So I got two days to think about it, but I, I really hate to miss out on 15% off. So I, I really have to think about it. So, you know how the other day I mentioned that I was getting into like the handmade soaps, the artesian soaps made with all the natural ingredients. And then since I got into hoodies um, with that, um, the mystery box that I got a couple months ago, that is so fun. And Alexa reminded me uh, today at work that um, the mystery box for October was going live. So I did log on this morning. There were six left. And um, so I was able to grab one. I went on a little while ago and it said four and then I went on again and it was six so maybe some credit card purchases didn't go through so anyway right now there's six left for the October mystery box hoodies suds and bubbles I'll leave it below so then I got um, some items that I got I ordered some regular soaps from her and then I got one from oodles boodles that I showed the other day and then I got the set the sudsy one and so anyway, I did again. I went to another small shop and on Etsy called Jess Some Soap. Her name is Jessie and name of her company is Jess Some Soap, another small Etsy shop. But, um, you know, it's just so nice. I got that came in today. And, uh, you know, she hand wrote on the back of the bag. She included a nice thank you note and just a handwritten note inside. And it's it just means so much. With every, you know everything else that's going on, that a small company can take the time to just really show that they appreciate your business, and it just makes you feel really good that you're supporting them. So anyway, because I already did this twice, I already took the soap out of the packages. So I got a pumpkin latte one. This one was five dollars. So it looks just like a pumpkin latte with the coffee and the cream, and the foam is actually glow in the dark. It's got the pumpkin on top. A little bit of sparkles got the straw and this one it just smells so nice so it's oh like the pumpkin and the cinnamon and the sugar and the cream and a little bit of coffee just really nice the other one I, I i dropped and i broke it yeah i feel bad 
So this one is a beach themed one. So let me try to put it back together. And this was the last one that I got from her. So this is called Beach Wave. So you can see there's like the sandy beach and this uh, sandy part is supposed to be exfoliating. And then you got the ocean and then the wave that I broke off. And then the top of the wave has got some sparklies in it too. And I really can't pinpoint what this one smells like. Reminds me of a men's aftershave, something my husband used to have, but I can't place a scent, but something that could be unisex, something that a male could use or a female, but just a nice soft, soft scent. It'll come to me later, but it is really nice. I'm, yeah, so these ones were $5 each. And of course, I just got the one from the Setsy Club the other day and the Oodles Oodles and I got my Goody Soap. So now I need to find a nice soap dish to uh, show them off in. But anyway, I'm running out of time. I'm into six minutes now. So I just want to thank everyone for stopping in and visiting. And I appreciate your support. I hope you give this video a thumbs up and we'll chat again next week. Okay, bye-bye everyone. And go out and have a great weekend.